President Donald Trump on Wednesday signed an executive order to end his policy of separating immigrant children from their families on the border, after images of youngsters in cages sparked outrage at home and abroad. HHS also said in a release that it has a process to ensure that family members know the location of their children and have regular communication after separation. A complaint reported by the national news media is that some parents did not know where their children were and had little or no communication with them. The U.S. Immigration and Customs Enforcement ICE, agency has dedicated the Port Isabel Service Processing Center in Texas as the primary family reunification center. All parents are given the telephone number of an information line, which is staffed Mondays through Fridays from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. And each ICE field office will have juvenile coordinators to manage reunification cases. Most of the children are from Central America, especially Guatemala, Honduras, and El Salvador. A small number of children will remain separated, generally if the familial relationship cannot be confirmed, or we believe the adult is a threat to the safety of the child, or the adult is a criminal alien, HHS said.